Hello and welcome to day five of Stay Home Church, our devotional series where we aim to keep you encouraged, connected with the Word of God and connected with each other during the lockdown. Today's passage I'm sure you've heard before, but let's see what God has to say for us. I'm reading from Matthew 7 verse 12. So, in everything, do unto others what you would have them do to you. For this sums up the law and the prophets. Now, if you haven't read this before, I'm sure you must have heard some form of this before. It's one of the most quoted verses in the Bible. Um, but I want to just look at this in a fresh way. So first I want to say um, that what Jesus is busy doing here, Matthew 5, 6 and 7, that's why we've been focusing on it, is Jesus uh, is preaching one long sermon through these three chapters where he's building culture and he's describing for us the way that we should live in this culture that he is describing for us, in this culture that we want to build in our house church. And then I want to focus on the part of the verse that isn't often quoted. Right at the end it says, uh, for this sums up the law and the prophets. Have you ever wondered what that means? The law and the prophets is basically the Old Testament. And what Jesus is doing here for us, 2,000 years removed from the text, is he's redeeming the Old Testament for us. And he's saying that this isn't a different God in the Old Testament. It's the same God who's requiring the same thing from us right from the beginning. But then that begs the question, if God required this of us right at the beginning, why is it still so difficult to do? I mean, I don't know how many times you've heard this, but I've heard this dozens and dozens of times, and I still find it day to day difficult to walk in it by myself. Well, the answer to that is the only person who really can fulfill the law is Jesus. And for us, those who have the witness of the Holy Spirit living inside of us, this is what Jesus is encouraging us to do. And you have that witness of the Holy Spirit inside of you too. You can't do it in your own strength. You can only do it by relying on God. During lockdown, as we are divorced from um, maybe the way that you exercise or from just living life normally, going to swim, um, enjoying the sun, seeing friends, you're likely to start feeling a little bit alone, a little bit lonely, a little bit low. I want to encourage you, you're not the only one. And that might not seem like much of an encouragement, but let me tell you, you're gonna feel a whole lot better if you put this into practice. Try and reach out to someone else. Try and call someone, somehow make connection with someone else and do unto them as you would have other people do to you. Have a great day.